This is 26-year-old Alexandria Crest Boris. She was gunned down in a Kroger parking lot in South Carolina by 23-year-old Christina Harrison. It said that the two had an argument and Boris spit in her face and then turned around. At this time, Harrison put a gun to the back of her head and blew her brains out in front of her children. Now, now first and foremost, rest in peace to that woman because nobody should be you know, hurt or harmed in front of their children. But I'm going to tell you this one time and one time only. This is the beautiful thing about social media because you can hear people's opinions and perspectives from all around the world. I am from Los Angeles, California, and I reside in Las Vegas, Nevada now. But guys, where I come from, like where I used to live with my grandma is a whole different area where I used to live with like my mom and my other side of the family. Long Beach, Inglewood area or Crenshaw or any of those areas are not the best areas to live in. And I've seen a lot of things you shouldn't follow me here so with that being said i learned a lot of things you can't talk to people any type of way you can't do whatever the, the way every anything the way that you want out there you'll get smacked up real quick so i know for a fact the moment you and think you're going to be cute someone's going to come to your house and spray your ass and you're probably like oh that's dramatic some people don't let things go some people don't like to be embarrassed in front of others and some people will not put their pride aside for you because when you disrespect somebody they take that very serious like there's people in california that you call them the b call a man the b word in california they i promise you like i said don't do it but i'm letting you know this so what makes people in their right mind think you know what i'm gonna do this spit on you and then you're not gonna do anything to me that's the sad part. You think they're not going to do anything to you. Stop thinking. Stop assuming. Because once you start assuming, that's when you lose it all. And look what happened to this poor woman. If you can learn anything from me, and I don't give a shit if you like me or not, please watch your mouth when you say certain things, especially if you don't got fucking hands, especially if you can't back it up. People do not understand with this generation. Haven't you been seeing how people are? How agitated everybody is? How ready everybody is to pop off and smoke the other person? That's fucking insane. People are losing their life all the time. And ladies, I don't want to hear, men are the one who are only violent, because look at y'all. Y'all are doing just the same thing when you could have easily done something else. Me personally, y'all, I don't know if I would have went to the full extent of fucking emptying a clip on a girl. That's fucking insane. Um, but I definitely would not let nobody do that to me. You're not going to be spitting in my face. That is so disrespectful. I don't know what you have. I don't know if you have something. Whether you've been sucking 20 peepees, now you got that fucking cum dumpster breath all over me. I'm molly whopping your ass. But I would have done it right then and there, not in front of her kids, though. See, I'm a different type of breed. But like I said, rest in peace to her. I'm not justifying what this woman did. But like I said, tread lightly because not everybody's going to react the way that you want to. And if you start acting accordingly and being more cautious with the way you treat people, you'll have a better outcome. This type of shit could be avoided if you stop doing stuff like this.